guys AJ here today we're talking about themes so as you can see here on my iPhone 11 Pro Max I have a retro theme so as you can see you've got all this stock apps sort of here podcast files FaceTime notes got messages down at the bottom here I've got yeah mail music phone calls maps watch which obviously watch wasn't around then probably maps wasn't really either uh, wallet home contacts news calculator fitness blah 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 so I've got a little theme here wallpaper at the back I also got from somewhere else um, but the actual app in question is here so look at this they've got loads here so you can get these for free but I think once you've purchased one or two for free then you will get charged um, but let me see let's see this one here for instance so it shows you different ones yeah so Maloco um, that's the name of the the app I think you find so a look share up so yeah Maloco themes and icons by Alexandra checkout so it's a checkout so this is pretty good so if you go back so these do actually work as well so if you click on one go straight into your watch app and then you've got news as well so they do work so that is linked into your um, into your your stock apps basically um, you don't have to do anything else you just download it and that's it so if we go into the app store I could have done it on there actually and you put themes themes for iPhone and nowadays you have a lot of themes a lot of widgets because Apple now have opened up with um, iOS 14 and you can have so many different things it's not about how it used to be where you had a background and it pretended to be a theme now you can actually change all the icons the app icons and you can even build your own so come back out of that go back down and like I said it does work so if we find it somewhere on here where are you there you go app store again and there you go see easy peasy so right so if we go back into here and you've got a custom pack as well which is coming soon so this would be this one um, so what we got here download so that one's not working I've noticed actually with this um, new beta you do actually lose a little bit of um, Wi-Fi drop I've noticed anyway so this is the person that's developed this particular theme so you can actually add themes onto this um, app because it asks you if you want to thanks for your support so you can support him as well so you can do like tips um, which is quite nice as well um, but yeah I mean you know why should these people do these things for free at the end of the day it wouldn't be very fair with it so here we are so you've got this um, so if we allow view profile settings install theme allow close all right so yeah go into go into settings settings download profile install so just do my passcode go install so it's a bit like when you install a beta 
one of those battery things. Now if we come out, see now you've got a different one. So these are all so it's all quite mixed up. I don't know what this dum dum means and stacks or stacks. So these must be twit box and uh, Adobe Currents Dropbox. So yeah, so these are for third party. Um, your Chrome, Netflix, Google, Gmail, Kika, Photos, Crossy. So for different apps, Facebook, Messenger, Snapchat, YouTube, Cinemark, iHeart, TuneIn Radio. Um, yeah, even more here. Twitter, Uber, YouTube again. So there's a widget here. So this is from Wiggy, Wiggy or Wiggy, um, which is pretty good. Gives you quite a bit of information there. But with that, again, you can only have one for free, and then after that, you've got to pay, um, which I think is four ninety nine for a lifetime. I think it says there, Widgie. Not Wedgie, Widgie. Um, so yeah, if we go back to settings and uninstall that one, because it's not very good, I'd have to basically go through all of that. Um, profile. So if we take out, remove. So it's quite easy to remove, put in your passcode. Oh, wrong one. And then you click on remove. So quite easy. So that goes. Go back and I keep this one that was the one that I wanted because it goes to the wallpaper. So if we were to do that, oh, wiggle, wiggle. nice wallpaper there. Very good indeed. So that's it, guys. So it's just a quick one. I put a link in the description. Of how to get the the app um, on the app store um, and then it's just so easy to do because then all you've got to do is as you know with ios 14 you can hide um, the pages and then i could just have it as that but obviously with this one it hasn't got the third party apps to go with it at the moment another thing i've noticed i've emailed them but if you get a message come up you know, say if you haven't got it in notifications here to drop down and you only want it as the bubble that comes up, you know, the little red mark. It doesn't come up on these. And that only come up when you go into messages and then you see it. So I don't know if there's a way around that. Maybe not. Maybe there is. Maybe it's a bug. I don't know. But we'll see what they come back with if they do reply to my email. Um, but yeah, I'll put the description in the bottom and also with Widgie as well. And uh, that's it. So please rate, subscribe, and I'll see you all soon. Cheers, guys. Bye-bye.